Hey guys, welcome back here to the channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing a Great One Red Deer Guide on T. Alvaroa. Uh, I started doing my Great One Red Deer Grind on T. Alvaroa about four or five days ago at this point. I was doing it on Quattro, but I decided to switch over to Tay. And honestly, it has been better. I've been getting a bunch, of, bunch more stags down and got some cool trophies so, so far. Uh, there should be a trophy highlights video out with a few trophies in it and one really really cool trophy actually two really really cool trophies uh, Not gonna say what they are just in case the video hasn't come out, but I do believe uh, I'll upload that video before I do this one. But yeah today. We're gonna be doing a uh, Guide for red deer on Tiaboroa. So hopefully this can help you and let's get right into it So right here guys, we actually do have a map that I made this map has all the outposts circled as well sorry the quality's not good right now I'm filming this for my computer right now because I made this map on my computer that I use for school but it, it has all the spots marked the yellow is the spots that I have zones but that I'm not using the green is the spots that I am using right now for my grind and the cyan spots uh, it, are the spots that I've heard that there can be zones and I've seen people have zones there But personally, I, ha I don't have zones there or I haven't checked So yeah, the yellow is the zone is the places I have zones that I'm not using green I am using and blue. I'm just not for sure. It says it right there at the top. You can see that but yeah, there's the map um, If you want to take a screenshot of that or something to help you you can pause it and take a screenshot now But yeah, there's the map you can see I'm only using uh, sorry, it's a little bit off center. The something happened where the little where the dots moved a little bit to the left of where I actually had them, but you can still see where I'm at, uh, where I'm grinding at. I'm only really using seven spots to grind, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, seven spots to grind, and I have zones at five spots that I'm not using. But yeah, there's the map. Um. Like I said, the green are the spots I'm using, so if you want to take a screenshot of that, you can now. But now I'm going to show you what I do when I hunt those lakes. So getting right into it, this is where I start my runs at. At the bottom Pukimuaro Puki Lake, I guess that's how you pronounce it. Pukimuaro Lake. Uh, start at the bottom one where the name is in it. Spawn in at this tent, jump into this tripod, and shoot every single red deer around here. I have a zone that's by this tent that spawns... Uh, those red deer spawn in after a fast drive over here, so I get in this tripod, shoot the deer out of this zone, shoot them out of this zone, shoot them out of this zone, and shoot them out of this zone. There's also fallow deer zones here as well, but shoot every single deer at this lake, and after I shoot them, I fast travel over here and run around and pick them up, and like I said, when I fast travel over here, or when I get about right here, these deer spawn in, and I'll shoot those as well, and sometimes there's some that spawn in over here that didn't when I was in this tent, but yeah, spawn in this tent, get in this tripod, shoot every single deer around here, and then when I get over here, they spawn in and I shoot them as well. And then next, I come to the top Pukamara Lake, I spawn in at this outpost, run down to this tripod, and there is a zone here, I'm not sure why it's showing, but there is a zone right by this tripod that I sneak into this tripod, from what, when I get to about 250 out, 250 yards out, I start sneaking, and sneak into this tripod, and when I do, there's usually at least two or three red deer that's back here in this zone right here. So I call them out and shoot them with the bow. And then I shoot the red deer in this zone. Sometimes there's a zone right here. And I shoot the red deer over here as well. So that's pretty much it for this lake. Then next what I usually do is come down here to the river. Which is one of my favorite spots. I spawn in here. At this tent. Get in this tripod. Shoot the usually two stags out of this zone. And then shoot the two stags that are in this zone. And then I walk across the bridge and go over here and claim them and a lot of times there will be more red deer down here that I'll shoot if there are any stags but that's pretty much it for that spot then next what I'll do is come up to this little tiny lake up here and I spawn in at this tent I do have my tent a little bit too close so I run backwards a little bit uh, and get up on this hill, hill a little bit and I'll see the red deer that spawn in here and there's usually two stags Sometimes there is just one, but I think I've had three stags here at one point as well, but usually for sure one stag most of the time there's two at this little lake 
Then next, I'll come down here to the river, to this uh, other part of the river. I'll spawn in at this tent, run down to this tripod right here, and I have a zone right here that always has at least two red deer in it. Right now, it's just showing fallow. It's not showing a red deer zone, but there is a red deer zone there. Um, it always has at least two red deer in it, and I've had up to five or six red deer in it there. But yeah, it's pretty much it. Spawn in at this tent I have right here, and run down to that tripod, and then shoot the red deer out of that zone that's right there. Then next what I'll do is come up here to the top Rotuni Lake, and uh, spawn in at this outpost, run down to this tripod that I actually have in the middle of the water, because you can walk plumb under the water over on this side, but... Uh, go into this tripod, and there's a zone right here, and there's also a zone that's down here. There's a couple zones through here. I believe there's two zones in here, or maybe just one, but they're spread out all over this bank. I've had anywhere from two red deer all the way up to six or seven red deer just at this lake, and I didn't even know about this spot till recently. And then next what I'll do is come to the bottom Rotuni Lake, spawn in at this tent. I have a tripod right here and I have a zone over here and a lot of times they can be farther down here as well. So yeah, I've had anywhere from like one stag here and sometimes I'll even have six or seven stags here but it seems like there's always at least two stags. Like I said, every once in a while I'll just get one stag here but there's mostly every time you'll see about two stags, two or three and like I said, sometimes I've had all the way up to six or seven but that's pretty much it for my average run. That's what I'll do. I'll hit this lake, this lake, the river, this little lake, this section of the river, and then these two lakes up here. And I do have zones at this lake. And I believe I have zones over here as well. I'm not sure. They're, they're not showing up right now. But I think Red Deer can drink here as well. I'm not sure if they can drink here. I've heard that they can drink here. Like I said, that map that I made, you could look at that. Uh, but yeah, I have zones here. I have zones here as well, I have zones here, I have zones here, but I'm not using those spots, but yeah, I hope this could help you, um, I hope that map I made could help you, you can take a screenshot of that if you need to, but uh, yeah guys, that's pretty much going to be it for this one, I hope you enjoyed, thank you guys for watching, uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, I hope this could help you, let me know in the comments if there's any other guides you'd want me to do, but yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one, peace.